Hi, um, I'm Kelly, and I'm actually going to film a video of some of my art because I won't be able to show them off after Christmas because most of them are Christmas gifts. So, um, let's get started. So, the first painting I'm going to show you is... <sighs> Scream. This painting I did yesterday. It took me maybe 5 to 20 minutes to do. Um, it was inspired by my friend who lent me the movies to watch. Ah, I like to do dark art. Don't judge. Um, second painting I have to show off is a Christmas gift to my co-worker. Um, she said she really liked Christmas Snoopy, so I hope she likes this. This one probably took maybe half an hour to do, maybe a little longer. I don't know. Not too long. I kind of like co-work my art, and then um, when one's drying, I'll like work on the other and then go back to the other. So that's how that works. This one... If you haven't seen Spirited Away, you're probably not going to, like, understand it. But this is, like, No Face's face as a whole. And, um, I did this also as a Christmas present. Um, I grew up watching Spirited Away, and it is a very, very good <laughs> anime film. I highly suggest it. Next. I have these little birdies. Um, I did it for the family that I'm staying with. These three birds represent her kids. It's really cute. But yeah, this is also a Christmas present. Um, I tried to color coordinate to their house. Like blue and I guess like a uh, nude natural colors. So there's that. <clears throat> now, for Pink Floyd fans, I did this. Shine on, you crazy diamond. Um, it's very simple, and because it was so simple, I was very intimidated to do it. I don't know why, um, but I'm r I'm really into like realism, like portraits and faces. So when it comes to like symmetrical things. Uh, not quite there um it's just really intimidating for me but um i did this one as a request so yeah so i won't have this one all of these that i'm showing you like i won't have except for the screen one i might have i don't know next i have this cute little dude i don't it could be a uh, dude do that. <laughs> um, I was on Pinterest and I seen, okay, I, I Pinterest cat art and um, this came up and I had to give it a shot and I love cats so it was just something fun to do. I gotta start working on animals because I do a lot of like portraits and faces like I said. So I mean that's still kind of a portrait. It's a cat face so hey. <laughs> um, I have this weird mini canvas. I actually did this one a while ago. I'm not sure. I don't really like fancy it all that much. But there. That's when I like first started working on canvases. So throwback to. Let's see if I can grab this one without moving my camera. <laughs> okay. This is an elephant thing I did. Um. I actually start. this used to be completely different colors and they were so obnoxious and just not well coordinated that I actually redid it. Like it used to be pink colors and now it's green colors and yellow and blue. So I went from like girly to green. Okay, okay. I'm not going to say pink's a girly color but like I went pink to green. Okay. 
Now, I um, was waiting for some other canvases to dry and I just like wanted to do something. Like I couldn't like sit there and do nothing while they dried. So I um, splattered some paint and then I went on my phone and I had this so I super glued this and then I went on my phone and I found a quote from my my memo because like sometimes I'll just write random quotes like whenever I'm feeling inspired and this was the least depressing quote that I had <laughs> so um yeah this is just a fun feel-good canvas that I did another Charlie Brown um this one was actually a request too um then I posted it on Facebook, like, she, I think, just wanted me to do it for her, like, but then I posted on Facebook and then someone else offered to buy it, but, um, yeah, anyways, I'm keeping it for now. So, yeah, this is, a uh, Charlie Brown Snoopy. I added the heart thing, like, when I looked at it. I, I found that on Pinterest, too, so... Okay. Okay. <sighs> okay. This is another one that I just did. Um, I don't know if you can read those words, but um, it says tough times never last, but tough people do, and then it's just like some weird lightning things. It's just um, something to inspire before an event. You can just look at it and be like, yeah, yeah, what's up? What's good? Um, so there's that one. Now I have this. I was at um, Michael's and I seen these little buttons and I seen that on Pinterest that someone did like a button tree. So I was like, you know what, these little flowers are really cute. I'm gonna do something with them. So I made like a cute little like, light, bright, pastry, tree, flower thing. I don't know, I think it would look cute in like a little kid room, but yeah, so there's that. Um, I like the color coordinations. It's very light though, so I might go back and darken to give it some contrasting. This is for my friend for Christmas. Um, she's going off to college, and so I made her something kind of dormy. She's really into stars, so I wanted an ombre effect. Plus, I made her something um, last Christmas that this will kind of like go along with, like match it. <laughs> um, yeah, so those were my art projects. Um, wait. Okay, so I have, have one last couple things to show off um, before I give them away. I already wrapped these, so like that's why I'm like. Um, so these were f are for my other coworker, um, and they're like a little collection, and I have like little little easels to go with them so any Harry Potter fans out there <laughs> um, yeah so these are all going to my co-worker and then she's got a little easel she can like set them up like on her desk hopefully she likes them but yeah this is what I did for my Christmas gifts and um, this is just kind of like a canvas tour and you can see like in the background some art hanging up. I can do more videos like this of me just showing off like art. I can show off my portraits, I can do makeup tutorials. So yeah, whatever you guys like want, just let me know. Boom. Um, thanks for watching.